please do not forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the notification bell so you're notified when we upload new videos. Mr. D. Hello. And Mrs. D's Robotics. You will notice that we are doing a lot of things for our Spike Robot ADB, Advanced Driving Base. And for this video, what we're going to do is to teach you how to program our Spike Robot starting, for, uh, starting from configuring it, then moving forward to programming it. So I do hope that you like this video as we show you how to uh, program the robot from moving forward, then backward, making a U-turn, driving in circles, and turning left and right. And by the way, this will be divided into two parts. Thank you. Let's start by launching our Spike software. We're now here and let's click on home, click on new project, the new project. And we're now here with our programming canvas. We see our palettes. At the bottom of the palette is the extension icon where other blocks could be downloaded and used. Check the hub dashboard. This will connect you to the Spike Hub via Bluetooth or cable. And you can also check your hub's information and what are connected on each of your ports. You could also check and manage your programs up to 20 maximum. Let's make sure that we configure the robot first. In configuring the robot, start with the movement palette. From the movement palette, look for your set movement motors to connect it to our start block and make sure that the ports are correct. For this port, we want it to be E and A because our wheels are set up in a way that the E port is connected to the left wheel and the A port is connected to the right wheel. Now, after configuring the wheels or the set movement motors, then we're going to make sure that we configure the speed. We can increase or decrease depending on how fast or how slow you want your um, robots to be. After that, we're going to go to our more movement palette and we're going to drag the set movement motors which has three modes brake which is a hard stop hold position where you cannot move the robot and then float allows the robot to move when it stopped due to momentum we will be using the brake mode robot movement is now configured we're now ready to program so let's start with the movement for the movement again we're going to make the robot move forward and then backward We've already set up and configured. So let's start with having the robot move forward for I would like to choose rotations and would just like to do 2.2. And then it's going to be moving backward. So 2.2 move forward and then I want it to move backward. So where is the backward? It's as simple as this and then just click on backward and let's go back to our original place 2.2 change it to rotations and we are good now what we're going to do is to download our program you can do download you could also do streaming now i'd rather do download so i'm going to download it and it's a zero program downloaded and then I'll just click on play in order for it to be executed. Now let's go back to home and click on new project or simply click on the plus sign and you'll have your project number two. For project number two, we're going to be turning left and then right. We have our start button and we're going to again configure the robot. Okay, 
then we wanted to move for about 30 centimeters so I'm using centimeters right now you can drag it up and then after moving forward for 30 centimeters I would want it to turn to the left to the left and then to the right and so I'm going to be using our A. I'm turning the left wheel first turn for about one rotation and then I'm just going to copy it and go back to the other side and I want it to move backward for about five centimeters and then I would want it to move again but now we're changing to E and we're going to do it the other way okay you just copy it same rotations and then once they're done I will just need it to go back to its original almost original so I want it to go backward and for about 20 centimeters so now we have set our program and let's click on download and we're going to play it.